LexisNexis is the single most valuable of all the credit reporting agencies because it is used to verify every other credit reporting agency's reports. LexisNexis is a consumer reporting agency regulated by the Federal Fair Credit Reporting Act FCRA. They collect and provide the following data about you. Home ownership, education history, phone service history, address stability, voter registration, payday loan inquiries, economic trajectory of last move, property value, professional licenses, bankruptcies, liens, judgments, and evictions. You should send this dispute letter prior to making any disputes with the three main credit reporting agencies TransUnion, Experian, and Equifax. Where to send your LexisNexis security freeze letter? You can place a security freeze with LexisNexis by submitting a written request using one of the following options. Online at www.optout.lexisnexis.com, by mail. LexisNexis Individual Requests for Information Suppression PO Box 933 Dayton, OH45401, by email. Privacy.information.manager at LexisNexis.com. For security purposes, your signed written request must include the following. First name, last name, birth date, your current address, your current phone number, social security number, proof of identity note. LexisNexis will not be able to process your request if you fail to provide any of the above listed information. Note. If your driver's license or government-issued ID is not current or does not show your current address and DOB, submit a legible copy of a document from each category listed along with a legible copy of your driver's license or other government-issued ID. If you do not have a driver's license or other government-issued ID, submit a legible copy of a document from each category. Once you have provided all of the required information and sent this dispute letter to the data furnisher, wait about five days for the data furnisher to apply your security freeze. You can expect them to respond within five to 10 days. You should receive a security freeze response letter with instructions on how to remove your security freeze. How to remove or reapply a security freeze. Send your signed written request by mail, email, or online. You must include the following in your request. First name, last name, birth date, your current address, your current phone number, social security number, proof of identity document, your PIN number. Keep your PIN number safe, you will need this if you seek to lift or remove your security freeze.